So, it's me, your little boy Kiss Samson. I have something special for us today. They thought that they have all it takes to be you. <laughs> you got what I'm saying? Their own thoughts, their own thinking, their own mindset is that they have all it takes to be you. They start to copy cut to join the fake ones that they have before. And now they end up realizing that no matter how they copy cut and do anyhow, they can be you. All they thought is that they have everything to be you. And they end up disappointing their own self because the aim of them coming into your life was not was never to do or to assist you to help you. They're just doing competition, secretly competition, to do more better than you. Listen, we have a lot of people who thought that they have all it takes to do or to uh, at work. They have all it takes to be more successful than you, to be this, to be that. Not focusing on their own self because of envy that they are seeing around you. Not focusing on whom they really are, but focusing on yourself, focusing on what God has given you that give them the breast. A lot of people are depressed today because they can never be you and they don't have what it takes to be you. And it's too late for them to discover because they started the competition so long. So they are now frustrated. Why is it that they don't have accurately what it takes to be you? That is why many of them are regretting why they started that competition. Because why is it that they can't just, they don't, they don't know what it takes to replace you. Because they have finally come to understand that you are irreplaceable, unchangeable. And that is frustrating a lot of them because there can't be you. They can't act the way you act. They can't do the way you do. They can't. They can't just. They, they just don't know why. Is it that it is very, very hard for them to not be like you? For them not to be able to do the stuff you do, or pos possess the thing you possess, or achieve the favor you are achieving, or do the stuff that you are doing. So a lot of people are secretly what frustrated because they can never be you. And that really frustrates and annoys them. Because no matter what they do, secretly, copy cutting and try all means to be you, they end up failing. No matter what they do, try to outwork you, not, not without you knowing that they are secretly doing competition to be more successful than you. No matter what they do, try to plug you down on your behalf, you end up winning the battle which you don't know of. <laughs> and that really frustrates many people because after all that they have done and did, you end up disappointing them. And they can't just figure out why your lifestyle is so attractive, why your lifestyle is so incredible. Because you are the sources of, what, of attraction. They don't, don't know why wherever you go, you get favor. And they themselves who thought that they have all it takes to be you, wherever they go, they can't just be like you. People don't love them the way they love you. People can't just commit the fact that they are like you. They never approve they're them. That's why that many of them start to behave, act the way, you know, dress the way you dress, do the stuff you do, because they are copycatting everything, but they end up failing yourself. And that is what frustrates a lot of people, because it becomes too hard for them to be you. <laughs> that is why someone who come into your life for, for some reason, for some purposes, 
also automatically become your enemy you also will just be like ah why is it that this person i love so much why is it that this person I, 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 you know i can't stay in a day communicating with them you know, i can't stay two days without having a relationship of communication with them i, I can't stay in it in, in an hour without sending in a message she is always there for me he is always there for me and suddenly now nah, he just become my enemy what have i done god why have you allow this to happen god if, if it, it is the, the sin of my forefathers that is affecting me like this that everywhere i go people hate me so love me but god why now why now because they can't just be like you then if they can't be like you they will be against you God, though, if they can't be like you, which is the aim of coming to at work you, to just be better than you, be attractive like you, be special like you, be unique like you, if they can't be that, what do else do you expect choosing one? They will hate you. <laughs> they will hate you. Why? Because they can't be you. So remain blessed and be blessed. So if people hate you, you are thinking they don't hate you. They hate you because of your offense. And you know within you didn't do anything wrong to them. Just know that they can't be you. And they have tried all means to be you. Either in one angle to another. That is why they suddenly turned against you. Because if you don't like them, you leave them. <laughs> so may God bless you. Remember